I got pregnant with my daughter when I was at seminary, which was a really interesting experience. So that process of becoming a mother and bringing a new life into the world was interwoven with my theological studies and my biblical studies. And, you know, so I'm reading something like Jesus talking about uh, be humble like a little child, right. you know, which honestly is one of those verses that never made much sense to me. Like, what do you get from being humble well, like a little child? Also, which child, right? Yeah. Yeah. Which child? Right. Um, or, you know, love. Mm -hmm. um, or learning that the root word for compassion in the Hebrew is comes from the word for womb. Mm -hmm. um, it gave me this really beautiful lens on a mm. lot of that, that I then, I think, continued. I think I took that into my children's childhood. I mean, with humility, that's one that's important to me. I, yeah, that humility of a little child, I just like, you know, great, but that's not going to get me anywhere. <laughs> um, but I just remember this, I had this one day or my daughter was very young and I had a place to go. And instead of getting where I wanted us to go, I was with her, it took us half an hour just to get one block because she was absorbed in every creature, every bird, mm. every person that walked by, just amazed at all of it. And I realized that that's what Jesus was talking about and that mm. humility, that spiritual humility, because we think of it culturally as debasing yourself, right? Making yourself small, making yourself vulnerable, perhaps making yourself unsafe. Mm -hmm. But the spirituality of it, the humility of a child is about approaching everything with a readiness to be amazed mm -hmm. and a willingness to be surprised and kind of opening a space for others to be big rather than mm -hmm. for you to be small. So I, I found it, I found, I found parenting very theologically rich. Thank you for watching Faith in Focus. You can find more videos like this on our YouTube channel and subscribe so you never miss an episode. To learn more about how you can have your story featured on the show, visit americamag.org slash faithshow.